Okay, everybody, and in just a few levels, I've gone from about 50 or so thousand damage, maybe 60, to 167,000 damage. And I'll show you uh, how I arrived there in a second. Got some you need stashed? Through all my money, though, dude. Keep an eye on this. <laughs> so, before we go for a tour, here's the equipment that gets you there. You take this belt, okay? Which gives you a plus one in Dream Mastery, okay? You get, uh, this metal, which gives you uh, transconvalescence, it's the plus three to uh, it's the damage to summon nightmare and the burn damage, and vitality damage, and bonus to pets that I pushed for. Plus, it's part of a set. And as you look through the set, you get plus eighty defense, one hundred percent all damage, eight hundred health. <coughs> pets gain fire damage and burn damage and on the fourth set you get plus three on the level of the summary nightmare it uh, confers minus 25 uh, percent fire resistance to sands deep not sure if I use that skill and then you see the trans uh, convalescence stuff there <coughs> it also gives you the sun summon nymph and this particular one is even stronger and that's that uh, this little one down here, which is up here, you got these two, anyway, um, that's just, you know, I just, uh, uh got these, you know, a little while ago, and one of the things you do is, because this, these two were, were in this, this thing here, you look here first to see what, what you can get for a good set, and stuff like pants and boots, I went into uh, here and here to look for stuff like, as you can see, lightning damage, right? And over here, lightning damage. Although elemental damage is like fire, lightning, and cold, it seems like if you concentrate on one, it, it seems to do better for everything. Plus this chain lightning thing here, it's just... This is like the lightning god. <laughs> and as you can see, you take the, the this set here, the Helios set, right? Okay. And I took the Divine Kraken's Fist. Okay, and I took two of these rings, okay? Because of their elemental damage bonuses. And there's that there. And uh, this one here, which gives bonuses to both Dream and Star. And if you want to see how this works, we're going to go over here. Uh, and I haven't even hit the... Uh, Hopefully I killed that. That is so nice. The key to this build is to keep moving. Stay away from the guys that blow up too. You can you can kind of hang at the side and let the lightning and your powers take care of them. I up the difficulty here, so that's why I'm getting more loot, more money, more everything. Mom! 
That's pretty swift. <laughs> this cough so I don't know whatever yeah. oh yeah gotta go the other way You notice the pets aren't dying either? Yeah, lightning. <laughs> There's a lovely monster. <laughs> Thank you. 
ability. It's just it, it's OP <laughs> because you can just go 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 go. You know, I did that, I went around them and then went in. By then, most of them are dead. Be careful here. Like there. Oh, get out of there. See, okay, I gotta keep moving. Yeah, I gotta keep moving. And you gotta remember, folks, okay? What makes this build even stronger than it really is is the fact that there's literally just past half the devotion points, okay? <laughs> it's, it's just. It's real hard to start this character out and find gear and everything else for him, but if you're patient, it'll work out. And it's literally one of the, you know, other than the Sparker, this is one of the easiest classes. You just, you just basically point yourself at stuff. 
Watch. <laughs> you know, boom. Uh, oh. So anyway, I will let that go. And um, like I said, guys, I will. What I'm going to do is flush out his devotion points, get him to 100, and that'll be the final build. Okay. And I'm thinking, and that's with a potent with this vitality potion. If you got a, a potion of mastery, you could be doing over 180 thousand now. And I'm thinking you might, I might be able to see if I can push it to 200 grand. Um, if I put, um, it'll depend. It'll depend. Two of the points have to go to physique, and then I can put something different on the uh, the legs. But, but still, oh, and uh, resistances. Let's see here. Dun, 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 dun. Weak on piercing and bleeding, as well as stuns. That's the one thing that gets you. Another thing that gets you if you get held, which is a form of stun, right? So, yeah, yeah it is what it is. But this is just another. I like this build because it's so quick, too. And that's the other thing to say here is that. It, it it makes it easy to travel about because you can those little white circles that are actually loot drops you can aim at one and it'll take you there but it won't hit it okay so you could go you could go right through everybody and then just ding 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 ding, ding back you know and, and that's the other point to make here is that it, it, it for grabbing your loot this is also a a build that seems to destroy boxes easy and you know, and all that stuff. You always find something new and fun. And like I said, because there's so many variations with this mod, right? I, I, I did the math, hey guys. If I was to try and do every single build to 100, it could very well take me three to five years to do this. <laughs> How's that for uh, content, you know, and, and value for your money? You know, I, I just, you know, despite the, and this is despite the fact that the mod maker nerfed how you get these tokens, okay? Like, you, then you get guys like me figuring, figuring out ways around it, and I haven't updated, and I won't update, because I'm not losing my characters. I'm kind of sick of that, right? Anyway. I think I'll finish my level. <laughs> anyway, guys, see you later.